Tidy up for me. Look at the mess I have made. You always leave your mother to tidy up, don't you? Yes, and she always does. A very bad thing for both of us. Well, take care of yourself. Now turn up again before you know where you are. Be a good girl. If there was anything I could do for you, I would. But there's nothing doing. We're full up. Now, leave me alone. But please, Mr. Wakefield. Oh, confound it, man. Clear out. Oh. I wandered lonely as a cloud that floats on high o'er vales and hills. When all at once I saw a crowd. A host of golden daffodils. Number 38, Chivesti. Eight o'clock tonight. Believe me, madame, with me you have nothing to fear. I am this itself. Our love will be like a secret symphony. I am not as others begging for garters, locks of hair. No, no. Just give me some simple little thing with nothing personal about it at all. You know, gold cigarette case, cufflinks, spell stud, Rolls Royce. You know, just some simple little thing. How's that? How am I doing? Grand. Romanian iron guard is a life. An officer, but not a gentleman. How well I know them. If you stay here in Romania, you would make a very good living. Thank you very much. Hear some more about yourself. Mm. Yan Tartu. Mm. Enterprising chap, aren't I? By the way, what happened to the real Tartu? He met with a fatal accident. Oh, you fellas have been busy. Here are Yan Tartu's papers. His membership card of the Romanian Iron Guard. But until you cross the border into Hungary, this passport describes you as a Greek merchant. Paterless, a mythical character. Am I all right as a Greek merchant? Well, you will be when you get your overcoat on. But don't worry, you're all right until you cross into Hungary. Everything's fixed for you. But once you cross the border into Hungary, you must destroy that Greek passport. Then present yourself to the German consulate, Seged. Seged. Well, the name Miller. Dr. Miller. Dr. Miller. Now, you must get your visa for Czechoslovakia from him. We'll be standing by tomorrow night, as arranged. And then from Seged onwards, well, uh, we can't be much used to you. I must struggle along on my own, eh? Yes. Mm. It's not going to be too easy. Now, one last memory test. I don't want to take any unnecessary chances. The whole thing is one big chance. Now, when you finally get to Pilsen, the man you contact is... Peter Valek, a shoemaker. His address? 38 Reichstrasse. Good. Now, remember, he's our only remaining contact with the Czech underground. So you realize his importance? Quite.
Heil bitte, what is it? What is it? Friend of the Reich, Dr. Müller. Yes, yes, yes. Please, please, let me in. They're on my heels. Please, why do you wait? All right, all right, all right. Friend of the Reich, eh? Yes. I need proof of that. Proof. Please. Romanian, huh? I ran the border. The Hungarian patrol would treat me no better than my own people if they got me. No. They tried. I left one with a broken jaw. Come with me. But if they should see me come here, they were on my heels. This house is German territory. Ah. Please. Heil Hitler. Heil Hitler. Your papers. Hmm. Romanian Iron Guard, is hmm? Your rank division battalion. Captain, second division, Bucharest battalion. Who sent you here to me? Colonel von Setter at your legation in Bucharest. You have his letter there. Hmm. Says some nice things about you. But damaging to the Reich if this had fallen into the wrong hands. Strange he gives you such a letter to carry across two borders when he could have used the telephone. Maybe he thought the telephone unwise. Maybe. Sit down. Colonel Van Wetter, German legation Bucharest. Dr. Müller, consul speaking. You know Colonel Van Wetter well? Oh, but of course, of course. Like a brother, all these months we work together, hand in glove, shoulder to shoulder. You really think that is necessary? I do, most necessary. Does it bore you? No, 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 not in the least. I'm only worried that you should go to so much unnecessary trouble on my behalf. Don't you worry about that. Where do you intend to go from here? Well, von Vetter thought I could be of use in one of the munition or chemical plants in Pin. He thought I could be of great use. They need skilled men. I am a skilled man. I'm a skilled chemist. My only wish is to serve the Führer. Heil Hitler. Von Vetter thought you could give me a Czechoslovakian visa and recommend me to the authorities in Pin. Yes, it says that here. Hello. Is that Colonel von Vetter? This is Heinrich Müller, Consul Siget, Hungary. Yes, Siget. What? I can't hear you clearly. Oh, I'm sorry, Colonel, to get you out of bed, but this seems important. Yes, I have a man here, an escaped iron goddess, Jan Tartu. Did you give him a letter to deliver to me? Yes. He's here now. Oh, then you did give him a letter. I'm sorry, Colonel, yes, perhaps I should have rung you in the morning, but it seems so important. I assure you, Colonel, I, I'm very sorry. I, I, I'm sorry, Colonel. I, I'm very sorry, Colonel. Do everything you can for him. Good. He's convinced. Great. You sounded like Dr. Goebbels with a bilious attack. Well, let's wind up and get out of here. I can. 